I'll put it to, I'll put it as urgently as I can. You must get along with each other. If you want God's blessing on your life and you want to be known as a child of God, you must learn to be a peacemaker, Jesus said. God blesses those who work for peace, for they will be called to the children of God. Notice Jesus didn't say, blessed are the peace lovers, because everyone loves peace. Neither did he say, blessed are the peaceable, who are never disturbed by anything. Jesus said, blessed are those who work for peace, those who are actively seeking to resolve conflict. Peacemakers are rare because peacemaking is hard to work. Because you were formed to be part of God's family and the second purpose of your life on earth is to learn how to love and to relate to others, peacemaking is one of the most important skills you can develop. Unfortunately, most of us were never taught how to resolve conflict. Peacemaking is not avoiding conflict. Running from a problem, pretending it doesn't exist, or being afraid to talk about it is actually cowardice. Jesus, the Prince of Peace, was never afraid of conflict. On occasion, he provoked it for the good of everyone. Sometimes we need to avoid conflict, sometimes we need to create it, and sometimes we need to resolve it. That's why we must pray for the Holy Spirit's continual guidance. Peacemaking is also not appeasement. I don't know what that word means. Appeasement? Yeah. Where does it mean? Appeasement. That means to, like, placate somebody, to be very, like, okay, fine, I forgive you, whatever, and not really care about it. Uh, okay, gotcha. Always giving in, acting like a dormant, and always, and allowing others to always definitely run over you. Definitely don't do that. Huh? I definitely don't do that. Yeah. And allowing others to always run over you is not what Jesus had in mind. He refused to 